Hi everyone, it's Marissa from the blog BumblebeeApothecary.com. Welcome back to my channel. Today I would like to show you how I make my product labels. This was a request from one of my blog readers and I thought that it would be a really great video to share with you because if you get into making your own skincare and personal care items, and especially if you want to offer them for sale or give them away as gifts, it's really nice to be able to have really cute and also professional looking labels to be able to put on them. So I wanted to share my process of how I actually make my labels as well as make it really easy for you guys to be able to make your own. The way that I actually make my labels, um, to be honest, involved quite a bit of work. So I actually use Photoshop when I design these, but what I'm gonna do is provide a downloadable template that you can actually get that has most of the work done for you so that you can skip all that hard stuff and then just get to having some really nice labels. I'm going to provide a link below where you can find some labels just like this, either brown or a white background so that you can print those off yourself. There's also going to be a link to where you can get the downloadable template so that you can use that. I'll have that all ready to go so that you guys can download it, easily print it and use it and start having some really nice labels on the things that you're making. So next, let's just kind of jump in and I wanted to show you a quick peek of how I design and make these labels in case you're interested in that. Let's jump in and I'll show you how I do it. So here we are in Photoshop and I'm just going to show you kind of what it looks like an inside peek on what my design looks like. But I have my text here with different sizes and different fonts and I have my B design that I've actually drawn this B and then I used an app on my phone called Adobe Capture to transfer it from a picture of my drawing into a digital file that I can use in my designs and I'm going to put a link to that app below so that you can grab it and use it if you'd like to use artwork in any type of digital files. It's really handy. I was really pleased with how it worked. And then I'm going to show you my back of the label here and this is just another circle and then it has all of my text here that I needed to include and then and then here's what the file looks like where I actually have the entire sheet of labels. So what I do is I make this layer visible so that I can see all these little circles. I got this template from the company that I get my labels from, planetlabel.com. I will put a link down below to their website in case you'd like to check them out. They do only sell labels in larger quantities though. So um, I'm also going to link some labels of the same type from Amazon in case you want them in a smaller quantity. Either way, you'll have resources for both of those, depending on what your needs are. But I leave that layer in Photoshop visible so that I can see where to drag my designs onto both the front and the back labels. And then once I'm ready to print, I go down and I make that same layer with all the circles invisible. And then that way I can print and then those circles and then obviously the logo company information won't be down there either. And then I'm able to print that onto the label sheets in my printer and then they come out nice and ready to use. I did find a really great tutorial on YouTube for how to get the text on a curve like this and I'm going to link that below because I found that super helpful. Everything else as far as the normal text and then just dragging in my image file and everything that like that was pretty self-explanatory and easy but if you have any questions feel free and leave them for me below in the comments and I will definitely answer them. Okay, I hope that you found that interesting and helpful, and I hope that you enjoy the free template, the printable template that I have designed for you guys, and I'd love to see it on some of your things that you make, so be sure and take pictures of the things that you make. I will. There's a link below on where you can find me on Instagram, so be sure and tag Bumblebee Apothecary on Instagram so that I can check out what you guys have been making and how you use the labels. It'd be really fun to see. Okay, if you found this helpful and you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Share it with any of your fellow DIY skincare and personal care product friends who might want to have an easy way to get some really nice looking labels on their products. If you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. I make new videos every week on traditional health wisdom and living a sustainable DIY lifestyle. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.